Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video here on Hypixel Scott Buck. And today, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we got ourselves a different set. I mean, this is a set that I've uh, used before in one of my videos when I was a mage. Well, I still am a mage, but, you know, it was like oh, a pretty good set. I mean, it still is a good set to use, uh, I guess, for, mm, well, I don't know about Archer, but I think for any other class. And also healer. Nah, I would say this is like for mage and berserks and tanks. I mean, eh, I feel like you gotta change it up with the tanks. I feel like this one would be good with mage for sure and then berserks i mean the only thing about it is because of the helmet clowning around since sometimes you do get into that scenario where you almost die and when you're a berserk so yeah it's better to regain all your health and uh you know have immunity and then obviously you get some strength for three seconds only but you know what dude this helmet does help out if you are a berserker in the catacombs so yeah but today we're gonna be testing this out last video and uh, we obviously use the zombie knight armor you know it was a uh, pretty good you no know, i do like it but now i'm gonna compare it with this armor instead dude and the zombie soldier plus the uh bonzo's mask obviously the combination three-fourths of it and uh, yeah we're gonna compare the two i guess sort of i mean we're just gonna look at the health and defense now i see this one is a uh, fully tiered out so you know these ones we're missing three <laughs> of the sets that need to get tier five but you know what whatever dude it's just a little bit of an upgrade but uh yeah anyways yeah today i'm gonna be using frozen scythe with this one because why not just to slow down some mobs but I think I'm gonna do some floor two runs though instead of floor three as I was gonna do some floor threes but I want to get some loot since uh, I do want to get like certain loot since I want to get the legendary for my uh you know scarf's thesis into a grimoire instead I want to get that upgraded for sure so yeah all right so health we gain 2.3k defense we get up to 1400 okay you know what not bad and then with this one gain more speed but you know the health is uh completely trash so yeah but all right dude let us uh ready up and see how this goes you know and i'm gonna be using just the adaptive blade and the hyper cleaver only and then i see the frozen scythe as well even though i don't need to you know i see use it as much right now well since this you know dungeon doesn't have the whatchamacallit dude the shadow assassin so this frozen scythe isn't really gonna come in handy that well but I'm still going to be possibly using it. I don't know. How much damage do I actually do? Hmm. I'm not sure. I did tear up my hypercleaver to tier 3 now. Just need a, a little bit more gold. So that I can max it out. I do want to max this thing out. So I need to go up against a lot of uh, King Midas's. If I want to get a whole bunch of gold essence. Obviously. Uh, with this golden, you know, hyper cleaver. Oh yeah, I need to see how much... Okay, only 400 with this, but let's see with the regular mob with this frozen scythe real quick. I just want to see, uh, how much is it? 8,000? That's pretty good, you know? I mean, at least it slows them down. So, that's like the one good thing about it. I mean, this, I do like this. I want to get to at least like lower health, but at the same time, I'd rather get it once we're at the end and see if I do get like my immunity or whatever. Proc with this cloning around, because I've only tried it once. And I don't think it worked that one time, but I want to try it again and see if it does work, which I'm pretty sure it will. <laughs> but sometimes, you know, it might not work. <laughs> you might just die right off the bat, like, real quickly than before. And that guy is uh, having some trouble. I don't know, wait, did we get the... We did not get the wither key. Where is the wither key? It should be somewhere right here. Yeah, it's this guy. Yeah, so apparently they changed the mage, like, thing, whatever, where the little aoe damage that you do you don't gain your mana back which uh i mean i did play mage yesterday i didn't really see it like that to be honest with you i mean it worked for me but i guess i gotta retry again and see if the mage did get like that nerf or something i don't know about that nerf to be honest it's kind of dumb but you know what whatever i guess it was a little bit too op before somehow <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I mean, Hypixel, you guys can do you. You know, if something's OP, you can do it. And I guess you have to, like, regularly punch it now. Like, you have to be in close combat if you're, like, a berserk or anything. So, yeah, that sucks, dude. Yeah, I'll have to take a look just to make sure. Because I was doing some floor four runs with it yesterday. And, uh, yeah, I wasn't really having any trouble. Yeah, I feel like they decreased the bats as well. I don't know. I might have to, like take a look again because i did not see no bats we didn't have to do the decoy strategy which was pretty nice to be honest and we finished it within like five minutes <laughs> the boss at least so yeah our runs were like 10 to 15 minutes max but yeah compared to this you know this three force zombie soldier plus the bonzo's mask versus the zombie knight 
yeah this one is definitely better you know you get more health and defense and the zombie knight you gain a little bit more defense than this one but it's pretty much still the same it's just that this set you gain more health so that's the one thing i like about it because right now i would have like what 2000 or something with this class so that would suck to have to be honest with you so yeah i'd rather use this 3-4 set versus like the zombie knight armor i mean the only thing i like about the zombie knight armor is pretty much just the speed of it which do you know that one is a uh, pretty good i like it you since you get like 20 speed per set whatever i don't know if i should do this to be honest with you dude as a berserk this is like a bad idea for me i don't know but we'll try it dude i mean i do have the bonzo's mask so you know what we'll do it we're, we're trying dude oh boy this is like the one way that i can test out if um this item ability does work or not but eh, we're not even gonna be able to even figure it out where is he where'd he go i lost him he's dead all right we're good combo that goes for 50k i should definitely get myself a combo on my weapon for sure with this class i would say unless there's like another enchantment that might be better for like weapons at least but uh no 50k it goes for like what up to a hundred thousand so I don't know. I might resell, might not. We'll see. But uh, we did not get ourselves the scar studies, unfortunately, dude. That sucks. So, well, I'll take whatever. You know, I got myself combo. I'll take it. Yeah, I think I might use this uh, armor set instead, <laughs> to be honest with you. Yeah, instead of the zombie knight here right now, I feel like this one is better uh, since the counting around. And then this one, I mean, you just combine it with your zombie knight sword. You know, you only get 50 extra defense and then you get 30 strength with the zombie knight with, the, with that for like full set. And I mean, eh, whatever, dude. And I'm gonna also have to test out with the frozen scythe combination floor three. Uh, going up against the shadow assassin since it is uh, definitely good to use it against that guy for sure. I wanna try and solo it, you know, solo. Shadow Assassin with the Berserk class. Possible if I have some mobs around me so that I can heal myself here and there. If, you know, my healing does work. <laughs> but yeah, dude. Anyways. Yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Just wanted to see how much health and defense I've already gained with this one versus the Zombie Knight. And if it's better than the Zombie Knight, yeah, I would say it is. You know, I'm sorry, Zombie Knight, but it's just like... I feel like this one's a little bit more better. You know, you get more health, so you can have a little bit more, you know, damage dealt to you. And then the uh, Bonzo's Mask, you can obviously regain your full health, as long as it doesn't glitch out or anything, as long as you don't die too quickly. <laughs> and then the immunity can work, and then, uh, yeah. It is a cooldown 298 seconds, though. Now, depending on your catacombs level, whatever, the higher your catacombs level is, uh, the lower your cooldown will go. Because before it was like 360 seconds for me, but now it's up to 1098 since I am catacomb 17 and I am close to 18 so that I can finally use my ornate zombie sword I accidentally upgraded way back in the day. Because I was like, you know what, I kind of want to upgrade this thing, but uh, yeah, unfortunately, that yet to be catacombs level 18 to even use the ability or even do damage with it. So. Yeah, catacombs level 18 required. <laughs> but, uh, you know, pretty soon, dude. And then this one, yeah, I don't know. I might resell or I might keep it or later down the road just in case. If I lose this one somehow, yeah, that would be a bad idea. But you know what? Whatever. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bonzo plus three-fourths of the zombie soldier. I would say is better than zombie knight. Unless you like speed, then you can go for zombie knight. But if you want health and the same amount of defense and have a good ability just so that you don't die as a berserk yeah i feel like uh, this set will be good and now i see adaptive is number one unless is there another set